Sam starts off today's game with a mountain, followed by John playing a vine glimmer snarl, Tom playing a tapped god of the shrine, and Extra playing an island, alongside everybody's favorite, Soul Ring. Sam kicks off his second turn with a mountain and a Grenzo Havoc Razor. He passes to John. John plays a Morphic Pool, then casts Farsi, finding himself a tapped Zagoth Trial before passing the turn. Tom plays a Dragon School Summit, then casts Brazen Dwarf. He passes. Extra plays an Island and casts Ethereal Investigator, triggering its effect to make three clues. He then hands it back to Sam. Sam plays another mountain for turn, then goes to combat, attacking John with Grenza. John declares no blocks, takes the hit, and exiles his top card thanks to Grenzo. In his second main, Sam casts Hazard's Monument and passes. John plays a Tainted Woods, then casts his commander, the Wise Mothman, giving each player a rad counter. Tom first mills one to Radiation, he then plays the Haunted Ridge, followed by his commander, Mr. House, President and CEO. After that, he passes. Extra triggers Radiation, milling one, losing one life, and a rad counter. This triggers Mothman, giving itself a counter. He plays an island, then casts Tezzeret, Betrayer of Flesh, using his plus one to draw two and discard Everflowing Chalf. This also triggers Investigator, who makes a spirit. Sam triggers Radiation, milling one, losing one life, and a rad counter. This triggers Mothman, giving itself another counter. He then casts his commander, Rose, Cutthroat Raider, triggering Monument to discard and draw. Next is yet another mountain, followed by a Grenzo attack on Tom, which gets blocked by Mr. House. Rose triggers at the end of combat, making a junk, which is immediately sacrificed to exile the top card, and make a red, which is used to cast Burgi, god of storytelling. He then passes the turn to John. John triggers radiation, milling one. He then casts Ruin Crab, followed by Stitcher Supplier, milling three when it enters. This then triggers Mothman, giving a counter to itself and Supplier. He then casts Aftermath Analyst, again milling three, and putting a counter only on Mothman. Mothman then attacks Tezzeret, triggering its effect, giving each player a rad counter. Extra Spirit flies in front of Mothman, keeping Tezzeret safe, and on his end step, Extra sacrifices a clue in order to draw a card. Sam triggers Radiation, milling two, losing one life, a rad counter, and triggering Mothman to give itself a counter. He then plays a Sacred Foundry tapped, and passes a turn, with Extra once again sacrificing a clue on the end step to draw. Extra triggers Radiation, milling one, losing one life, a red counter, and triggering Mothman to give itself another counter. He first activates Tezzeret's plus one, drawing two cards, and discarding Taurian's Soul Cleaver while making another spirit with Investigator. He then casts Inspiring Statuary, followed by Sage of Lot Nam. His commander, Piper Wright, Public Reporter, and an island to end his turn. Sam triggers Radiation, milling one. He casts Veronica, Dissident Scribe, triggering Bergy to Anna Red. He then sends Bergy at Tom, and Rose at John, who blocks with his supplier letting him mill 3 and trigger Mothman on Crab and himself. Rose then triggers, making 2 junk, one of which is sacrificed immediately to exile the top card of his deck and make a red with Rose. He uses the mana to cast Reckless Fireweaver, followed by Loyal Apprentice from Exile, triggering Monument to discard, draw, Veronica to make a junk, and Fireweaver to deal one to each opponent. He then activates the remaining two junk, exiling two cards from the top, casts Ruby Medallion from Exile, triggering Fireweaver again. He then finishes it off with an overloaded Vandal Blast. To 
to which Axor responds by sacrificing his clue to drum. After all the artifacts are blown up, Sam passes. John triggers radiation, milling two, losing one life, a rad counter, and triggering Mopman to give itself a counter. He casts Ramen Up Excavator, and uses his effect to play Hinterland Harbor from his graveyard, triggering Crab, making each opponent mill three, making Mothman give all his creatures a counter. Mothman then attacks Sam, triggering its effect to give everyone a rat counter. He then passes a turn to Tom, who casts Anguish then making on Loyal Apprentice before going to his turn. Tom triggers Radiation, milling two, losing one life, a rat counter, and triggering Mothman to give Ramanap a counter. He plays a Bright Climb Pathway for turn, and casts Celebrate Thousand, who at the beginning of combat rolls two dice, triggering Dwarf to deal one to each opponent. After that, he passes. Extra triggers Radiation, milling one, losing one life, a rad counter, and triggering Mothman to give Ramanap a counter. He first ultimate Tezzeret to make an emblem, then casts Urza, Lord High Artificer, making a construct when he enters. Using his effect, he taps the construct for a blue, triggering the emblem to draw. He then uses the mana to cast K9 Mark 1, which is again tapped with Urza, drawing another card. Having drawn a couple of cards, he plays a Mystic Sanctuary, followed by Clan Crafter, before passing the turn. Sam triggers Radiation, milling two, losing one life, a red counter, and triggering Mothman to give Crab a counter. He then goes to combat, attacking Tom with Rose, John with Grenzo, and Extra with Veronica. Veronica triggers on attack, discarding, drawing, and making a junk token, while Fireweaver deals one to each opponent. We then go to blocks, where Crab blocks Grenzo, and Sage, Piper, Urza block Veronica. Rose again triggers, making 3 junk, and dealing 3 with Fireweaver. He then sacrifices all 4 junk, to exile the top 4, plays the Mines of Moria from exile, cast the Man Answers from exile, discarding a card, cast Flaming Tyrannosaurus, triggering Monument to discard and draw, cast Imperial Recruiter, Triggering Monument and Recruiter to search and cast Inti, Senesol of the Sun. Again, triggering Monument. Next is Anaheb the Eternal from Exile, Triggering Monument, and now also Inti, exiling the top card, and Tyranno dealing 3 to Ramanap. He casts Quicksmith Genius from Exile, triggers his stuff, casts Spellwarstone from Exile. Triggering Tyranno, Quicksmith, and Inti, cast Wild Magic Surge from Exile on Mothman, triggering Tyranno, Mothman transforms into Elza the Deep Shadow, he then evokes Fury, to kill Urza, and finally passes the turn, with John flashing in a Soaring Thakti. John triggers Radiation, milling 2, losing 2 life, and two rad counters. He recasts the wise Mothman, losing one life, and giving everyone a rad counter. He then attacks Sam with a thief, triggering his effect to mill each opponent for two, allowing Mothman to give a counter to all his creatures. Tom triggers radiation, milling two, losing two life, two rad counters, and triggering Mothman to give itself and the thief a counter. He then recasts the Vandal Blasted Mr. House, President and CEO, and goes to combat, triggering Celebrate Thousand, rolling a 6 and a 3, making a robot, a treasure, and dealing 1 with his dwarf. He then plays a shadowy backstreet tapped, keeping the card on top, and passes. Extra simply casts a Nice of Traken, plays a tapped Myriad Landscape, and also passes the turn. Sam starts yet another long turn with attacking John with Imperial Recruiter, Tom with Tyranno, and Extra with Fireweaver. 
Nysa blocks Fireweaver, and Crab blocks Recruiter. While Rose makes another 3 junk, triggering Quicksmith and Inti. In the second main, Naheb triggers, making 9 red, followed by Nalfeshmi from Exile, triggering Monument, Inti, and Tyranno. He then casts Crime Novelist from Exile, triggering Monument, Inti, Nalfeshni, and Tyranno. Next is a Diamond Pickaxe from Exile, triggering Nalfeshmi, Tyranno, Quicksmith, and Inti. He then casts the ready, Scrap Savant from Exile, triggering Tyranno, and uses his minus 2 to sacrifice Pickaxe and return Mindstone, triggering Quicksmith, and responding to it by sacrificing Mindstone to draw. He then sacrifices 3 junk tokens, followed by Jessica's Will, exiling 3 and making 6 red. Among the exiled cards, he casts Keeper of Secrets, which is copied with Nalfeshmi, prompting each opponent to concede. 